Hello everyone and welcome to another very beautiful and a very exciting chess game of Paul Morphy. And in this game Paul Morphy is playing with the black pieces and his opponent is John William Schulten. And in this game John William Schulten made some very important, significant blunders against Paul Morphy so that's why this is one of the shortest games between Paul Morphy and Schulten. So John William Schulten starts the game with playing e4, e5, f4, king's gambit, accepted, bishop to c4, knight to f6, knight to c3, bishop to b4, e5, attacking the knight, and Paul Morphy played d5, attacking the bishop, e takes on f6, d takes on c4, f takes on g7, and John William Schulten is attacking the rook, so Paul Morphy played rook to g8, knight to e4, knight to c6, b3, and in this position Paul Morphy played queen to d4, and Paul Morphy is attacking everything, attacking the knight and attacking the rook on a1. But in this position, white could defend, but unfortunately, Schulten made a blunder and he played queen to e2 so probably his idea was if queen takes rook on a1 then white has knight to f6 that's check and that's a discover attack to the king and also attacking the rook and after Schulten played queen to e2 Paul Morphy captures the rook on a1 and in this position the better defense was knight to c3 this was the better move, but then black plays queen takes on g7. And black is better, black is winning. So Paul Morphy captures the rook with the queen, queen takes on a1. And Schulten played knight to f6, that's check, king to d8. And after this move, he realized that he made a blunder, so he played c3. But it's too late for Schulten. If knight takes rook, then queen takes bishop, king to f2, then bishop to c5, check, king to f3, and then knight to d4, forking the king and the queen. And if queen to d1, then bishop takes on d2, queen is pinned, so king to e2, but then knight to d4, check. King to f2 or king to f1, it doesn't matter. Queen takes queen. And this is losing for white. So we have c3. And Paul Morphy played. Queen takes on c1, check. King to f2. Bishop to c5. King to f3. And Paul Morphy played a very beautiful deflection move. He played knight to e5, sacrificing the knight. Queen takes knight, and then queen to f1, king to e4, queen to d3. And Schulten captures the pawn, king takes on f4. Paul Morphy played the last move of the game, and after that move, Schulten resigned. Paul Morphy played bishop to d6. And John William Schulten resigned. So let me show you the possible continuation. Queen is pinned. Black is winning the queen. So if let's say queen takes on d6, queen takes queen, king to e3, queen takes knight. And this is over for white. So that's why after Paul Morphy played bishop to d6, Schulten resigned. And another very simple, very short and a very entertaining chess game by Paul Morphy. So I hope you have enjoyed watching this video and I hope to see you next time. Take care. Bye bye.